Hi, I'm Nick Amister, the Program Director for the Integrated and Independent IR Residency Programs at UPMC and the Associate Program Director for the Diagnostic Radiology Residency Program. We are very excited to take this opportunity to show you our program. At the core of any great interventional radiology program is a great diagnostic radiology program and UPMC hits a home run with this. Building upon the fundamentals of the excellent DR foundation which is laid down in the program's first three years, our integrated residents learn to master all clinical aspects of radiology. But you don't just spend the first three years within the core diagnostic program only doing DR. You also gain fundamental procedural experience in IR as well as other procedural areas of radiology such as abdominal imaging, musculoskeletal interventions, and spinal interventions to just name a few. We have developed a robust simulation training curriculum that has been established within our department and the residents enjoy it tremendously. The fourth and fifth years of the integrated program are dedicated to IR training. The IR training program is spread across the core academic centers of UPMC and the Pittsburgh VA Hospital. The beauty of incorporating all these sites together creates an excellent opportunity for you to gain an amazing breadth of clinical and procedural experiences with dedicated faculty members at each unique site. Hi, I'm Phil Orans. I'm the Chief of Interventional Radiology here at UPMC. With the integration of the interventional and diagnostic programs into the combined IRDR certification, we've definitely made some adjustments to our clinical model over the past 30 years. Uh, we have very much adopted the clinical model of interventional radiology, the essence of IR people being uh, clinician proceduralists uh, or clinician interventionalists, not just proceduralists alone. The way the clinics work is that we don't necessarily have our trainees at every clinic every week, but we try to allow our trainees to get experience at multiple clinics throughout their time here, spending some time at the fibroid clinic, some time at the vein clinic, etc. And it's very important for continuity of care that the patients that are seen in the clinics by the trainees, if they should happen to get a procedure down the road, those trainees really should be involved in the procedures for those patients. That's how we maintain continuity of care. Ideally, we like to have them involved in the follow-up of these patients as well. Admittedly, that's harder to do sometimes with our, our clinical uh, schedule, uh, but that is our goal with respect to our clinics. At Presbyterian, you will not only perform basic IR procedures, but get intimately involved in all aspects of trauma and transplant-related procedures. You learn about GI and GU interventions, including biliary and portal hypertension, and are involved in our liver oncology service lines, including chemoembolization and the Y90 treatment programs. At Shadyside, you work alongside IR attendings in providing complex cancer-related IR care including image-guided ablations. Additionally, you gain a solid foundation in dialysis work, including the creation of percutaneous fistulas within the IR department. At McGee Women's Hospital, you will be involved in the IR, fibroid clinic, and the venous clinic, learn basic and advanced procedures such as uterine artery embolization, and how to clinically manage postpartum hemorrhage with interventions. UPMC Mercy is our second level one trauma center within the system and the region's only comprehensive burn center and serves as an additional training site for you. At the Pittsburgh VA, you will gain additional vascular experiences. At all sites, the department provides full IR consultation services where you will learn to evaluate patients and be involved in their preoperative and postoperative care. You will participate in daily clinical rounds, maintain inpatient lists, and closely follow all our inpatients. My name is Dr. Anish Gadadra. I'm an interventional radiologist and medical director of the UPMC 3D printing program. Our program started in 2016 with the mission of using low-cost, high-quality 3D printing to create patient-specific anatomic models to improve quality in patient care. Using CT and MR imaging performed here in radiology, we can create life-size models of patient anatomy 
that allows surgeons and clinicians to practice and plan for procedures beforehand. With these 3D printed models, residents and fellows can plan and practice procedures before performing the real thing on a live patient. Uh, residents in our program have the opportunity to work within the lab and learn the process from start to finish and become experts in this exciting new modality for radiology. Within our program, you will participate in dedicated IR clinics in subspecialty areas such as uterine fibroids, a dedicated vein clinic, oncology clinic, and even a venous malformations clinic. Every Wednesday morning, all our IR faculty members and trainees get together for the weekly dedicated IR conference. This includes didactic lectures, root cause analysis meetings, case conferences, and journal clubs. Residents participate in both DR and IR multidisciplinary conferences, including several tumor boards. Your radiology training is just not only in our department. You will spend a month in the busy transplant ICU learning how to take care of these complex patients. You will spend a month with the vascular surgical services learning how to take care of vascular diseases. You will also spend some time on the UPMC stroke service. So for those of you that are smitten with the IR bug, I say welcome to this awesome field. Remember, over half of your IR integrated training is spent learning DR. Our residents are well trained in both. We will provide you with one-on-one, -on -one, shoulder to shoulder, training by both dedicated diagnostic and interventional radiologists at subspecialty based hospitals, all under the UPMC umbrella. Thank you very much for looking at our program and we look forward to meeting with you.